Who doesn't like guacamole? I don't see anybody raising their hands. Well, I've got a blueprint for guacamole that I think everybody's going to like. Let's get cooking with style. The ingredients are just basic. It comes right down to just some good avocado and some very simple ingredients. But one thing I realized is maybe not everybody knows how to slice an avocado. So you wanna get one that is ripe and then just run your knife around the edge. You'll twist it and there's the pit. Now don't do this barehanded. Put a cloth in your hand, take the knife and smack it in there good and give it a little twist. That's your avocado. And now to peel the skin off, just run the knife down like that. And we're using Haas avocados here. And these skins peel off super easy. So then we're gonna go ahead and mash our avocado up. And you can make this chunky style or you can get it really creamy if you'd like. I like it kind of just before it gets really creamy so I still have the bites of the avocado in there. And I like to work with that. That is the way I like to have my avocado. Now, as I said, the ingredients are really simple. So we're gonna start off with a bit, little bit of lime here. And if you don't have one of these little tools, this is great for margaritas or limes and or lemons. We're just gonna put in the juice of, in this case, we're gonna use one lime because this lime has got a lot of juice in it. And we don't want this to get too runny, okay? And this is how simple it is. We've got our cilantro, about say a third of a cup, finely chopped, finely chopped red onions. You can use white sweet. You can go with as much or as little jalapeno as you like. But remember, avocado is the star here, so we don't want to overpower it. A little bit of garlic, all right? And now we're gonna season this with some kosher salt. I'm putting in about a tablespoon. You can put a little bit less if you prefer to not have it that salty. And then some cracked pepper. This is about a half a teaspoon. And we'll put that in there. And so it's really this simple. I mean, we've got everything almost all together here. And we're just gonna fold all the ingredients in like so. Now, some people like to change things up and add all kinds of different ingredients here, but everything I put in here is really kind of just accentuating the flavor of the avocado. And that's what I like. I like to taste the avocado and I don't like to have the other ingredients overpower it. So now we're gonna serve this up and of course, avocado guacamole is best served with chips or maybe on a taco or something like that. So I'm gonna serve it up in one of these little beer dishes that they see in Mexico. And we'll put a little blue corn chips around the outside of that. I love these chips, they are so good. And you remember that salsa we made last week? If you want to, you can take a little bit of dollop of that and set it right in the center. And then you add the tomatoes in like so many people like. So. There is my version, the basic guacamole. If you'd like this recipe and a whole lot more, go to cbs8.com slash recipes for my basic guacamole.